Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4. This is part 110 of my let's play. Yeah, we have hit 110. Next episode gonna be a special episode because it be... Oh wait, we done passed the special episode of 111. Now, what is this fault suit that I'm wearing? <laughs> uh, do, do, do. Yeah, one, 111. Yeah, that's the next episode. I don't know what I'm going to do for that episode. I really haven't thought about it. I didn't think that that might be a special episode. But we have got the Corsa chip and we are going to analyze it. Hmm. I don't know what to do now for episode 111. Ooh. I don't know. Probably nothing special. <laughs> Because I'm not that creative, and I probably just keep walking on this main storyline. The glowing sea, Virgil. What happened? Ooh, we got level up. Uh, decoding chips. Sac sarcastic. Virgil, help. Don't have time. Uh, Do you know anything about decoding coarser chips? A coarser chip. You fought a coarser. Oh my god. Yep. Unfortunately, I can't help you. Why? I've worked on a lot of synths, but never a coarser. What the difference? I don't know what that chip does, let alone how to decode it. Dang it. But there are people who might. I work with a group that, well, they're the only ones I know that even have a chance at cracking Institute security. Oh. They're called the Railroad. Yeah, I know about the Railroad. I know them. Thanks, Doc. I know the way. You do? Oh, then good luck. I hope they can help you. I haven't done much for them, but I do know them. Hello. The memory Den's not accepting new clients right now, sweetheart. Irma. Oh, enjoying yourself and good night. Thank you. It's a heck of a town. I want to use one. Is Deacon still here? Is that Deacon? No, that ain't Deacon. Deacon half vanish. I guess he don't need to be following me around. He's waiting for me at Good Neighbor. I mean, <laughs> at the well load. Oh. Touched my phone and the phone went off. Do, do, do. So back to Old North Church. And while we're there, we can turn in our other quest. I wonder what would happen if we went there with the closer chip, just asking, "Hey, do you know how to defile this closer chip?" We don't know you, but closer chip <laughs> cobbled together from the. Oh yeah, I read that one before. That they're gonna have. Every issue of picket fences you collect as a new unique element to construct at any workshop. Hmm. That'd be cool to find. I don't know where all of them are. The only one I know of for sure is the one at Hardware Town. Which I think we already picked up. And of course there's that Wasteland Survival Guide that let you build pink flamingo fences. Not fences, but like the pink flamingo decorations at the tower by Coastal Cottage. I don't think we got that one yet. I don't know. Okay, into the old North Church we... Oh, that looked cool. The Pedwin just standing there. That's cool. Anyway, into the old North Church before we get distracted. By Bright Lights and the Pedwin. Okay. Oh, the door open. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. This away. Oh, they haven't. We just bond. Down the stairs and take a left and then another right and left and right and left and right. <laughs> Ooh, this we spawned. I'll gladly take it. Hey, Death to the Mona! He patched me up, oh. put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. Synths everywhere. Carrying you the whole time? Amazing, right? That's one word for it. I he did? He told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. So is any of that true? Uh, 
Sure, why not? Word he said was true, and then some. A full hundred. I can't even imagine. <laughs> See, just like I said, boss. I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. Mm -hmm. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. It was easy. You certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about or lied about anyone so highly before. <laughs> Welcome to the railroad, Agent. Yay! Okay, why should I join? Uh, why should, why I, should join? I join you? If you're having any doubts, you shouldn't. Not very many of us live to retirement. But if you're like me, that doesn't matter. There are great wrongs that need writing. Uh, sure, why not? Glad to be aboard. It seems we're very lucky to have you. So you're in. Oh, I wish Ada would have said something. Call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? Uh, just alarm? Can I have alarm? Let's see, professor, fixer. Have any suggestions? No. It doesn't work like that. Your life, your name, your choice. Uh, bullseye, whisper, and charmer. I like fixer. Think. It's a big decision. Take your time. Fixer. Call me fixer. Fixer certainly Cause seems I fix like everything. Thing. Your first <laughs> official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. Okay. But first, it's time to meet the rest of the gang. But no, I just wanna... <sighs> the location of our HQ is one of ours. Hey, Deacon. <clears throat> Welcome to the family. We're a colorful and arguably insane bunch. But you're stuck with us now. Speaking of which, if you don't mind a sidekick, let's keep a good thing going and travel together some more. Okay. Sure. Let's go then. I'm all ready to go. And Ada, you can go back to Sanctuary Hills. I wish they had like Ada talk to us, like they do with other people. Hey, Rook. The Hello. Next drummer boy. It's my envious job to keep track of all the dead drops and grab incoming agents and tell them where they're needed. Okay. I don't suppose you want to switch places. Uh, why that a bad job? A bad job. Runners at the bottom of the totem pole in the railroad. Just a hair above tourists. Being HQ's runner is a cut above field work, I suppose. Ah, someone's got to do it. We'll be seeing each other. A lot. Probably not. And After hello. You leave, I get to do a full security sweep before you can get out of here too. Mwahaha. Do do do. Open railroad HQ. And the loading is taking forever. Nope. Not as long. The amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe. Where are you? We've taken precautions oh. not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now, so there's plenty for you to do. Can I talk to you now, or will this interrupt the tour? Because I just want to talk to you about this Corsa chip. Now, I guess I can run the prototype there, that will finish that. Listen up, everyone. This is Fixer. He did the switchboard op with Deacon. He's a full agent, effective immediately. I'm counting on each of you to show him the ropes. Oh, Feel cool. free to welcome him aboard. That is all. I have a report here. Hmm? It reads more like a comic book. Apparently, one hell of a fight took place at Green Tech Genetics. Oh, wait. Oh? How did you know? Oh? What have you heard? One of our agents took a courser. Alone. Something I'm not even sure Glory could do. And that agent is you. I'm all for one less courser in the world, but why'd you do it? Uh, decoding, sarcastic. Do you decoding. know anything about decoding a courser chip? You have one of their chips intact? Follow me now. I guess that true using your fat man wouldn't be good. A million things can go wrong. The least of which is losing the data. Fortunately, we have the right man for the job. Hey, dude. You need something? Tom. We got Glad you signed on. Whoa, huh? For real? And I might get oh, to take man, the occasion on that off. You, you gotta be the careful, man. This. Hand over the chip. Let's see what's on it. Uh... 
What can we get off the Corsair chip? Those chips have more than just codes on them. Let's Everything try to get information for us. What it's made from tells us something about our enemy. One minor detail could mean the difference between life and death for our agents and the synth we're trying to save. Now hand it over and let's get it analyzed. I don't know. I'm keeping. Here you go. go. All right, Tom, make it happen. I love his hat. His hat looks amazing. Use the back entrance. Too much traffic to the church and we'll burn this hideout. Okay. We're in. Chip access. Sweet. Just poke the analog connectors a little. What? Oh man, don't don't, don't crash. Hold it together. Memory here go. Here it comes. I don't Encryption know. algorithms. Alright. Oh, missiles. This is gonna be. Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh, man. We got lucky. Got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Duck. Guns. Kinds. Guns. Show me that. Dense. Duck. Guns. Yeah, we got it. We got the code. What, what was the code? Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya. I didn't see a code. Not sure our luck will hold up next time, guys. And agent, I hope that helps you as much as you've helped us. Good work. Thank you. Is that it? Am I returning? Okay, let's go. Things are quiet. First, for now. I heard you wanted the prototype. This. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training and us knowing hardly anything about you. Des has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command. But what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Uh, do you doubt me? What? You don't, you don't think I can handle a dangerous job? The danger doesn't concern me. Your work at the switchboard proves you can deal with that. I just hope the mission doesn't require knowledge about sins in our procedures. Something you've had scant opportunity to learn. <laughs> I'm here to help. Tell me what you need, Doc. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth. H222. So headquarters, as always, puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. The paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. <laughs> dead What's drop? What's a dead drop? Oh, shit. <laughs> I knew I forgot to tell you about something. Oh, dear lord. A dead drop <laughs> is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. Oh. It's a common means of communication for us. So keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper counter sign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. Yeah. You can trust me with this. I'll get it done. Just don't bother. Dang it. Up too badly. If things go wrong, I was hoping we could get the possession top. Stockton is a prominent businessman and I know I leveled up. You could stop flashing it. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Ah. I was hoping that just can be an XP drop. I'll let level up so the corner up there will stop bugging me about it. Hmm. What do we want? I've got what we was going for. And we can't do another one of them. That is already out. Get another strong backpack. Hmm. I do science. I'll get our science up. Oh, oh. Okay. Now let's head out to the glowing sea to talk to Volga. Way out here in the middle of nowhere. First time with Deacon travel with us, we go to the glowing sea. He's gonna be like, uh, this guy is crazy. Why did I want to join up with him? I had a robot repair kit. Nope. Oh, who cares about robot repair kit? <gasps> the death card respawned. That is bad. I seen it. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. Hello. Protect and serve. Protect and serve. Hmm. Anything good around here? Hmm. Cause I swore you had a book, but I could've got that. Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need. Yep. Have anything for me, sarcastic? Do you have anything for me? I'll take that as a yes. Can't say I'm too surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. Mm. How'd you manage to get it decoded? Duh, does it matter? Does it matter? No, you're right. It doesn't really. The point is that you got it. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. From memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the symbol explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest Ooh. part of the design? That classical music station, that's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I Interesting. want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. Uh, bioscience? Bioscience. Bioscience? Advanced systems? Divisions within the Institute. Specialized groups working on various projects. It'll make sense later. But Interest. if you can build this device and make use of that code, you should be able to override the signal from the Institute's relay. Can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. Well, will this work? I don't know. Don't doubt. I got it covered. Good, good. Because you've got to make it in there, for both our sakes. And don't you forget our agreement. Both our I've agreement. helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's my oh, only yeah. hope for ever being normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take Thank you. And get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Hmm. I guess right here was where we, like, make a decision of who to actually join up with. I know when I did it, I think I, like, when I was playing it by myself, I think I had the Welbo do it. So let's go with the Minuteman and let's hope we can get out here quick enough. Hopefully we got out here quick, quick enough to have it where... So let's go with the Minuteman. Yes, we got out of there before that death car, like, activate as a weapon. <laughs> I mean, as a weapon. As a enemy. So I'll go with the Minuteman. I really want to go with the Brotherhood. I never like going with the Brotherhood in Fallout 3. In Fallout 3, I wanted the Enclave to win. Even though I didn't agree with all the stuff. Hmm. New Vegas. I think I went with. I can't remember who I went with. I didn't. Oh yeah, I have weapons I can store. There we go, okay. Where is Preston? Preston, stop hammering. 
What do you need, General? <laughs> it complicated. All you need to know is there's a machine that can get me inside the Institute. The Institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? <laughs> uh... They kidnapped my son. Damn. That's some bad business. Even for them. We'll give you whatever help we can. Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing, what exactly does it do? Uh, Malik Institute Technology. Did you know the Institute has a teleporter? They call it the Molecular Relay. Teleportation? For real? Wow. That would explain a lot about how the Institute manages to operate. If anyone can make heads or tails of those plans, it'd be Sturgis. I haven't found anything yet that he couldn't build or fix. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. Oh no! In the meantime, no. Make sure to offer help to anyone that needs No, help. Preston. Only help our cause. No, Preston. One forward. <laughs> okay, I think we got away. Coming together, huh? I can't take all the credit. Preston, stay away. Preston thought you might be able to figure out these plans for me. Sure thing. Let's see what you've got. Okay. Uh. Do you think you can build this? Wow. What a mess. Hmm. Looks like uh, encrypted RF transmissions. Okay, so that gets routed through. What the hell? <laughs> Teleportation. This is some pretty crazy shit. You sure it's for real? Uh, I got this from someone who should know what he's talking about. Can you build it or not? Well, yeah. I think so. <laughs> anyway. The eggheads never think about the nuts and bolts of actually making something work. But, uh, looks like it's all here. Yeah, I'm gonna need some time to study this thing. The handwriting's pretty hard to make out. But, uh, you can get started on what he calls a stabilized reflector platform. Uh, it'll need some pretty high-grade metals, but it's basically not that different than the lining of a jet engine or something like that. <laughs> Can okay. you give me a list of what I'll need to build this platform? Yeah, sure. Here's a list of what you'll Thank need for you. the first piece. I'm pretty sure we've got all that at Sanctuary. If you want to build it there, while you're working on that, I'll get busy figuring out how to actually build the rest of this thing. Keep in mind, I can already see this is going to take a crazy amount of juice. Like Ooh. if you had a spare nuclear reactor handy, <laughs> we could probably use it. Right. And it's going to be big. So find a nice open building site with lots of power available. Okay, right there. Can I build it right now? Or do I have to actually go out and find the stuff? What is this? Ah, ah, we can't build it. Oh, we can build four of these things. Let's put it right here. Let's just move their gym equipment. We don't want a random settler being trans being just who is that oh that deacon How's it going? being randomly teleported into the institute signal interceptor uh yep yeah. yeah ready to build the rest of it good i think i got a handle on this crazy contraption oh no as much as i can tell well, until we actually try to build it here's a list of three things that may be harder to find i think i'll be able to pull together everything else we're going to need i'll meet you over at the building site and see if we can actually make this thing work Okay. I see Preston behind us. Oh, uh, better, uh, thanks. Thanks, Sturgis. I'll get right on this. Good deal. One thing to keep in mind while you're building this, it all needs to be wired together so all the pieces can talk to each other. I'll see you over at the building site. Good luck. Okay. <laughs> can we build it still? <gasps> we can. I guess, but yeah, we can build it in the middle of nowhere. I can still build more. <laughs> and let put the antenna right here. Just go ahead and wire that here, that to that, and that to that. Let's see, two, twenty, five. Dang, that's going to need a lot of power. 
Oh, too bad I can't just build that. Oh. Still need more power. I use the small generator because I think for the size they produce the most energy. Hmm? Ooh, ooh. Nope. So I need a little bit more power. And there we go. Quiet these a little bit down. They're a little bit quiet, I think. Hey. Oh, wait, not you. Everything looks good on my end. You ready to see if this thing actually works? Yes. Let's do this. You sure? Okay. Your part is simple. Just step onto the platform. I'll start scanning for an institute signal to lock onto. Then I fire her up and we see what happens. <laughs> okay. Cool. Getting cold feet. I don't blame you. I am. Uh, this be a step for us. That let's see if we can do something with our weapons fast. <laughs> I'm ready when you are. Okay, let's actually do this. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Ah, <sighs> just yep. Yeah. I did it. Ah, oh, that had bite. Guy didn't jump in the okay. middle. Is that bad? Hold real still. I don't want any corruption of the molecular beam. Oh, yeah. By the way, I figured this was a golden opportunity to find out as much as we can about the Institute and what they're up to. Yeah, it, this holotape's all set with a program that will scan their network and download anything it finds. Uh oh. Uh, yeah, we better hurry. And don't worry about that tubing wiggling around. It's, uh, just there for decoration. <laughs> hey, oh, that tubing. For the Institute signal. Uh, I think I jumped on the wrong spot. And got it. Hold on to your butt. Uh, whoa. Ah, oh, that that was nice. They had classical music playing in the background. I don't know if that will be played over YouTube. That was nice. Whoa. So what happened if like a sense now just. Also, want to come here? Hmm. Anything around here worth stealing from the institute? They have wonder glue and scalpel. They will now destroy themselves. <laughs> uh, Ooh, impact. Who said hello? I wondered if you might make it here. Hmm. You're quite resourceful. I'm known as Father. The Institute is under my guidance. I know why you're here. I'd like to discuss things with you face Where's the speakers? Please, step into the elevator. Never. I have something to hack. What was I supposed to put in here? He said holotape. Okay. Well, since this video thing can be over, we will. Uh. Be exploring the Institute in the next video, right now.
Uh... <laughs> hey, let's play a game on this institute thing. Oh, it actually works. Yes. <laughs> I bet they'd be confused. They're like, what? Is it this? No, I don't think it's that. Let's see. Let's see what the thing actually says that we should do. Insert network scan or hollow tape. Okay, we will log off as soon as I figure out what this what hollow tape we're supposed to put in here. Network. Uh. Ah, oh, right there, network scanner. Yes! Haha! <laughs> okay. Okay. Now can we just get out of here? So I guessing we did it? The thing we opened. Okay, so in the next video, we will explore down there and figure out whoever was talking to us. But, this will be the end of today's video. So, as always, I hope you all had a good day, night, whenever you're watching this. And as always, goodbye!